Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. In today's video, we have another project here called iBots.io that have real revenue streams, uh, real passive income, real revenue streams that aren't based on Pondinomics or anything like that. And we're going to be going over this today. But before we get into it, if you could please hit the like button, subscribe down below if you want to and turn the notifications on so you don't miss a future video. Make sure to go and follow me over on Twitter at JBKDFi, link in the description. Links in the description also to my premium Discord server, the free Discord server, as well as my email newsletter, if that's something you're interested in. Okay, with that being said, I'm not a financial advisor. None of this is financial advice. Always do your own research and be very careful about where you're investing in crypto and DeFi because it is the risky stuff in the world. With that being said, let's jump into it. So iBots is the first Forex and crypto AI trading bot service project. It was created with the goal of providing its users with passive income. So how to get started, create an account, earn passive income, send any money that you want. So minimum deposit is $250. Make a deposit, generate your um, sorry, I'm reading this in the wrong order. Create your account, make your deposit, generate your address, send any amount that you want. Minimum deposit is 250 and earn passive income. Okay, so about us, iBots is the first BAAS project, bots as a service. It was created with the goal of providing its users with passive income in the DeFi world. Most of the projects allow new users to come in. We wanted to create a project that won't allow newcomers. Why did I say that weird? Newcomers false promises or unrealistic gains whilst also still being able to provide a passive income for our investors the project relies on our bots performance and there is no reason our project won't stay for many years to come as long as our bots are profitable ibots is fully supported by a total of two different trading bots and expert team our experts have been tested bots for the last 18 months they lost money at the beginning because they had to find the best bot settings methods and calculations they tried hundreds of strategies before they got to the current strategies that we are using right now and our bots have not taken a loss in the past 12 months okay the team compro compromise uh, comprises of more than 10 members a business specialist professional developer social media expert blockchain expert bot expert graphic designers and economist working 24 7 to bring the best user experience and the best result possible there's a little faq here Okay, and all that good stuff. So if we go to the dashboard, I've been in iBots now for um, for about uh, since the end of December. So what's that, three months? They've been around for a while. They're not too big at the moment. And the reason for that is just because they haven't had much exposure. They haven't done any marketing. This isn't a sponsored video. They aren't paying me for this video. Um, Pocket Aces, good friend Pocket Aces, and doing big things in the space right now is part of the team and they also have a big team in terms of traders and all that good stuff so at the moment they are trading specifically with forex um, foreign exchange and if we go over to their bot you can see this is the main bot that they're using if we give this a refresh book this is uh if we give this is a refresh this is my fx book you can see there's currently fifty three thousand dollars in here and this is a live account and we can go ahead and see i think it says real account somewhere um i'm pretty sure it does but yeah, you can kind of see the different trades of so today. They've made 2%, okay? This week, 2.08%. This month, 8%. This year, 16%. You can see all the different trades that are currently open. They are in about a $10,000 drawdown right now, <clears throat> okay? But these are just some of the open trades. You can see their performance historically, 8% last month, 8% this month. Oh, sorry, 6% last month, 0.8% in January. So let me go and log in. I'm going to have to do my 2FA. So I'll pause the video and I'll come back once I am logged in and show you what's going on. Okay, so as you can see, this is the dashboard and you can see all of the different results for March, January and February. And since they started in November. Um, so yeah, uh, now as you can see, I have $1,000 in here. I did start off 250, which was the minimum. And I've just topped it up today to 1,000 total. And I'll probably continue adding to this depending on the results, just because, again, it's real revenue. And I quite like the team behind it. I spoke to them quite a few times. Aside from Pocket, obviously, I spoke to Pocket, speak to Pocket most days. Um, but yeah, spoke to the other team, Oren, uh, Daniel, and a couple of other guys. Pretty often, pretty good guys. So you can see the different calendars here in terms of what they're trading. Now, at the moment, they are trading specifically Forex. So that's why you see profits Monday to Friday. And the reason there was no trades here, here or here is, again, they were waiting for the Bitcoin shorts to close. So they were doing crypto trading as well. And that's why you see a day here for 6.81% is because they did close out a Bitcoin short trade. But now, so a lot of their money was tied up in here. So you can see there wasn't too many trades before this month. Uh, December was a pretty good month. 
But yeah, there wasn't too many trades in January or February because again, they were kind of just still setting things up. That's why they haven't done too much marketing at the moment. But this is real revenue. So you can see I've made $23 on 250. So just under 10% in really the last month as they've been actively trading. So I got in just a couple of days before Christmas on the 22nd, and you can see they've done two trades in December. Uh, there was only a couple in January because then they opened a Bitcoin short, which February didn't close and they were trading some with some funds that they had, which were pretty small profits. And then in March on the 9th, they did close that short there and they've been trading Forex ever since then. I do believe that is their goal going forward at the moment. Whilst this market, crypto market, which has been going crazy, is kind of settling down the R trading Forex. They didn't trade on these two days, again, because it's Bitcoin short, but also, you know, the Forex market has been going pretty crazy as well because of the banks that did get defaulted, okay? So, um, oh, sorry, didn't get defaulted, but had to be bailed out because of the bank run, okay? So as you can see, today it was a 0.3137% there. Yesterday was 0.519. So again, they don't trade on Saturdays or Sundays because... They are weekends and Forex is only open during the day, uh, during weekdays. So if we go to our withdrawal here, I think this is where we can see our profits. Um, yes, yeah, so as you can see, I did go and deposit another 750 today. But you can see today we made 67 cents, a dollar yesterday, 35 cents, 74 cents, two dollars and 69 cents, 50 cents. So you can see, you know, the profits do stack up. This was that six percent day, and um, we currently have about 23 dollars in profit. So. I can go ahead and, with, uh, and withdraw that, but bear in mind there is a pretty big withdrawal fee if it's less than 500 bucks. There is a five pa uh, five dollar withdrawal fee, and the reason for that is because you know the money is in their forex exchange, so that means that they're going to have to take the money out of the forex account to then go ahead and pay you out. So there's a, a bit of a high fee there for withdrawing under 400 dollars. I'm just going to let this kind of stack up for a while there. Now, if we go into the dashboard, I, there is a one percent. Uh, let's go to FAQ here. There is a 1% um, fee every 30 days, which is fair enough, in my opinion. You know, 1% fee. Here we go. How much are we paying? So the fees are 20% from bot profits only. This way we can provide you a commission. Uh, this way we can provide you a commission based on participation with no subscription fees. So you won't have to pay anything up front. There is a 1% maintenance fee as well every 30 days, which is fine. So they charge 20% of the fees. So it's an 80-20 split. And also a 1% fee every 30 days, which is fine in my opinion. Again, this is more of a long-term project. And um, yeah, they've been going for a while. They've been going since November. I think they started, if we take a look here, started on November. And uh, I got in at the end of December. And then, yeah, they've kind of just been building things since then. There's been a few more videos come out on them. And they're kind of building up this Forex account slowly but surely. I believe this is trading. If we take a look at the summary... Yeah, they are trading Euro USD on this account. They do have another account. So if you go into there, uh, again, these are the open trades. But if you go into there, you can see the kind of history here. Uh, open date was two days ago. You can see they've made 500 bucks on that one. Uh, you can see they made $164 here. A couple of losses. But yeah, they, they are trading crypto at the same time. This is kind of just their Forex account that they currently have live with 53000 bucks in it. So... I'm happy to kind of ride along with it. I think it's a pretty cool project. Again, I'm not sponsored by these guys. They haven't paid me to make this video. There is a referral link, which I will leave. If you want to check it out, then you can do. Um, you don't have to use it, of course. It's completely up to you. But yeah, that's it, guys. That is iBots. Now, good thing is they haven't really been making, and, and this is a, a props to the team. They haven't really been making money since they launched in November other than this month. And the reason for that is because, again, they were in a Bitcoin short. And all that stuff that they just closed out. So they weren't charging maintenance fees because they weren't making that much money back then. Now they've started to make money. They are going to start charging a maintenance fee within 17 days. Of course, this is just for me. If you're depositing today, then, you know, this will be 30 days from the day you deposit. But um, this is the ROI so far, which most of that has been made in March. I believe this has been like a yeah pretty high percentage. Like, what's that? 7% there, 8%. So probably like a 10% month. But bear in mind... This is not regular. This is when they cashed out that Bitcoin short they opened a couple of months ago. So just keep that in mind there. But yeah, guys, that's going to be it for the video. Pretty cool stuff. You can go and deposit using the deposit button over here. Either BSC, BEP20 or Tron. Um, this 750 deposit I just done on Tron. The first deposit I made down here on the 22nd of December I done on BUSD. They do have a Discord server. If you go over to contact us, 
you can see the Discord. Very responsive in there. They have Twitter as well and Telegram's coming soon. But yeah, they do have uh, Discord, which again, open a support ticket. All good there. Chatting away in the in the in 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 the general chat. Pretty helpful guys. So looking forward to seeing how this goes. And that's the reason I mentioned, by the way, about not taking the fee because although they haven't been making too much money, they've been making twenty percent on the trades they make. But the maintenance fee is where they're probably going to make the most money, um, just because you know they take one percent of the total balance here every thirty days. Um, so that's probably going to be their biggest money maker. So uh, and they haven't been taking that over the last few months as it hasn't been making money, which kind of just shows, you know, kind of good ethics from the team, which I like. So anyway, guys, that's going to be it for the video. If you have enjoyed, make sure you smash the like, subscribe down below if you are new. Let me know what you think of iBots and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.